Hey, what's up guys? It's Nelson here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install a transparent AccuWeather widget on your Galaxy Note 3. So let's show you guys the stock AccuWeather widget. Here it is. So we're going to be replacing this one with a transparent one. So before we start, you'll need it to be rooted and you'll need to have safe strap recovery or some other kind of recovery uh, on your Galaxy Note 3. Once that's all done and set, um, you should make a backup of your ROM. Uh, just in case anything goes wrong, it's always good to have a backup. In the article, you can find links to all of the new AccuWeather widgets. There's up to nine of them, so you can choose from those nine. Once you download the file, uh, you're going to be using a file explorer. I'm going to be using root browser uh, because that's the one I prefer. Uh, you guys can use whatever you guys want. So now I'm going to go into the root browser and I'm going to find the file that I downloaded. Okay, so here is the new AccuWeather widget APK. So I'm going to hold down on it and I'm going to copy it. And so now you're gonna to want to go back and go to System, App, and paste it into here. So I'm just going to paste it. Okay, good, and now it's pasted in here. Uh, we're gonna go back to it later. So now find the AccuWeather Phone 2013 APK and the ODEX file. You're gonna rename both of these, so I'm gonna tap on it to hold and rename and at the end of it, just add a dot B A K. This will disable them. So I'm gonna do that also for the ODEX file. Okay, and now both files are disabled. Now I'm gonna scroll down and find the file that I pasted in here. Uh, it starts with an M, so let me find it. Okay, and I found it and here it is. So now I'm actually going to rename it uh, just AccuWeatherPhone2013.apk. So I'm gonna get rid of all this crap in the front. I'm going to press OK. And now we're going to scroll all the way back to the top, and you should see a new file up here, accuweatherphone2013.apk. That's the one you just renamed. So now you're going to hold down on it, and you're going to go to Permissions, and make sure to uncheck these, and these three checked, and the top one. So now I'm going to press OK. And now the next thing you're going to do is you're going to get out of here and you're going to reboot your device and go into your recovery. So I'm going to go into the recovery. Okay, and here I am in my recovery. So I'm going to go to wipe. and I'm going to go to advanced wipe and check Dalvik cache and also regular cache. You don't always have to do this, but it's good to do it anyways. So now I'm going to go back and I'm going to reboot my system one more time. Okay, now your device is booted back up. So I'm going to unlock and your widget should be gone, the AccuWeather widget uh, is gonna be gone. So I'm just going to add the widget, just like you would before. And there you go, now you have a transparent widget. There are many to choose from, like I said before, there's nine of them. They all range in different transparencies, uh, different color font, and different effects. So check out the article to find the links to all of the widgets. All right, well, that's it. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out the full tutorial over at Gadget Hacks. All right, thanks, guys.